A Northern Virginia school was just recognized for its work in science, technology, engineering, and math by an international association, making it just one of 34 programs around the world to get the award this year. So I stopped by to see what's happening in and out of class. Walking into Nativity Catholic School in Burke, you'll notice to the delight of students and encouragement of teachers, All right, there you go. it's a little noisy. That act of moving around is how you're going to retain that information. Don't just teach them and tell them, get them involved to learn it and then they'll remember it. From using goggles and gloves in the science lab we need to, test the to collected rainwater for the school greenhouse. It's nice to get away from the classroom. These kids are digging into their education. So um, we actually grow a lot of food in here. If you think about it, actions speak louder than the words. It gives them an advantage uh, that maybe other schools may not have. Including the International Technology and Engineering Educators Association's recognition of Nativity as a STEM school of excellence. With us, science, technology, engineering, math, it's involved in everything that we do. When you walk through our classrooms, you're going to see that it is an engaging room. Not only have they achieved this recognition in STEM learning, in cutting edge learning, but we recently had our school play a musical. So they're developing their gifts in the arts and theater and the cultures being passed on. And I think that makes for the whole person. From pre-K to eighth grade, getting kids surrounding desks instead of just sitting at them and collaborating in classrooms 2.78 is making a difference. Oh. And it was so cool to see everybody up and about. When I was in mm. school, maybe for you guys too, you had to sit quietly, raise your hand, and then mm. maybe you'd be able to talk. But here, everybody's talking with each yeah. other, mm. with the teachers and with the students. It was really inspiring. They, yeah. get, they were making a computer there. They had developed their own phone <laughs> system. They yeah. were growing their own food. These children are taking over. They're <laughs> self-sufficient. That was so cool. Yeah. Some that was may cool. pursue meteorology. There's a yeah, lot of math, a lot of science in that. Yes, yes. So calculus is your friend for the first couple of years. But once you get past that, then you get into the fun equations of the atmosphere. And then you could be the yes. next Jordan. Oh, there you go. <laughs> uh, 